It's a hot summer day, and 48-year-old Craig Grote is starting it the same way he started every day for the last three years now, by pouring over the want ads, looking for a job. Bill, I applied for approximately 200 jobs in the last three, four months. 200 jobs? Yes. Any possibility that's out of those 200? No. It's not that Craig isn't skilled. For 12 years, he worked in shipping and receiving for a company called Air Tech Control. For six years before that, he worked as a cook aboard ship in the United States Navy. But with no job for the past three years, life for Craig, a husband and father of four children, has been at times mentally unbearable. I, do, I dig myself in such a big hole, Bill, that I can't sometimes get myself out of it. Bill has been, real, been a real struggle for me and my family. Be rough on you. Man. Yes, it has. But Craig it says it that struggle just, hit its highest point you know, two years ago when he suddenly had his state of Michigan unemployment insurance cut off entirely. Cut me off, saying that there was a discrepancy between me and my employer, saying, I, was, I say I was laid off due to lack of work. My employer says I was fired due to my attendance. You were there when they when they when they when they laid you off. You were there. Did yeah. they say you're fired or you're laid? No, off? he said I was laid off. He told me I was laid off due to lack of work. Yes, for nine long months, Craig went from receiving twelve hundred and eighty dollars a month to receiving nothing, not a zip. During that time, Craig lost a total of twelve thousand six hundred dollars in unemployment benefits that were rightfully his. First, Craig called a lawyer, and then out of desperation, he called the Call for Action team. And within 24 hours, we arranged for Craig to have an official hearing before a judge. Believe it or not, Bill, within four days, I got a letter from the, the judge saying, we find in your favor, your, uh, your employer owes you all the back pay from October of 2009 till June 2010. 24 hours after that. Craig got a check from the state of Michigan for exactly $12,600. I want to reach my arms around all of you guys and just give you a big old hug and, and say thank you. Thanks. <laughs> yes, we do solve a lot of problems, but it's not every day that we can hand someone a check for more than 12 grand. Tonight, we want to thank the Michigan Employment Security Commission for helping us with this case. By the way, we are also trying to find Craig a job right now. He says he will do almost anything right now, but his specialty is shipping and receiving. If you think you could give Craig a job, please email me at bspencer at wxyz.com. I'm Bill Spencer, the Call for Action Team.